Hey guys, Monster Man here, and welcome back once again to Golden Sun. Now, in our last uh, episode, we sailed across the sea from Calais towards Tolby, but we have landed on a mysterious island about midway there. We're dealing with our friends here, uh, Uranos, and I forgot his other name. Isaac, you talked to the passengers, did you not? The tour group is arguing about whether they should leave the ship. We'd like to go ashore and see if it's safer out there, but we promised we'd protect the ship. That is it, Isaac! Can you go out there and check to see if the island is safe? That's not what he said, but that's what he meant. I see, you are going to go for me, aren't you? I'm sure no one will complain if we scout out the island. Cool. There is no telling what kind of monsters are looking on this island. Be extremely careful! Cool. This should be a less chatty episode, which is kind of nice, actually. I've been doing a lot of talking the last few. So this is Crossbone Isle. There's a hidden dungeon here. How do we get to that now? Oh, sorry, I have my re-equip still, that's weird. Oh, and we're already half dead, right? Yeah, forever the boss fight. All right, all fixed. Now, we're gonna use a combination of our abilities, as always, to fix things. It reveals all we need for this. No, it's not. Can I drop down from up above that, maybe, then? Because otherwise, how do I get this? I could try to move the log. Oop, that's halt. That's the wrong one. Um, can I move the log? I don't think so. Nope. Can't jump that, either. Alright. Okay, well, let's go ahead and uh, switch a, an Earth Gin for a Fire Gin. That way we can get growth on either of these two. All right, we'll go ahead and switch them back because I don't want them on the other ones. There we go. Climb the vine. Oh, never mind. We need to do it again. I was wrong. I switched back a little too soon. You guys are having a fantastic Fourth of July, by the way. For all of you down in the states, be sure to enjoy yourselves, spend some time with your families. You generally have a good time. Quick, keep it on just in case we need it. Yeah, we do. Okay, we do need it again. And there's a whirlwind as well. But yeah, so hopefully you guys all have a fantastic time down there. It was uh, Canada Day on the 1st. Um, and I had a good time. Up here. Because the uh, 4th of July, you know, it comes around once a year and it's a great time to just have fun, you know. Appreciate the, the, the country that you, you live in. It's awesome. Alright, you need catch. You have catch. Cool, so if I drop down here... There we go. Gets you a mint. Not sure if a mint's all that useful or all that good, but it's a mint. Alright, a couple more places to drop down. I'm gonna drop down here next, because I think we can drop down from, from here to the next tier down as well. One coin. Bit of a ripoff, really. Oh, no, we cannot. And back up once again. Seems this puzzle is intent on making us take our time about this. It's not too bad, though. Alrighty. There we go. And down, and across for the whirlwind. Ooh, a cave. What might be in the cave? I don't know. Let's find out. Let's uh, switch the gin back. We're gonna go ahead and put them into butt kicking mode because I'm assuming there's enemies down here and it's just faster to nuke them with summons than to actually fight them oh this goes further down this is like a, like a, like a, like a, like, a, like a proper dungeon somebody somebody made this place hobgoblin virago virago so it has boss music too so that's the we've, we've gone straight to the big things it's a weird sort of a dungeon but all right Summon Thor! Odin's son. And so far, no, the, ob the Cobgoblins survive, but the Viragos are down. Follow up with Judgment. And down. Uh, okay. Level 18 Guard, learn the Guard's Flare Storm. Windseer, learn Tornado. Good job, Ivan. Very nice. So you get to enter the puzzle room by beating a boss at the door, by the looks of it. Interesting. If we move this this way, we gain access to that chest over there. I 
111 coins. Cool. Let's go this way. I don't know what the correct solution is, or the best solution is for this, but... As long as, as, long as we're getting to chests, I think we're basically doing it right. Hard nut. Wasn't, wasn't, that, wasn't the one who uh, raises defense? Oh, I had one on him already. Oh. How long have I had that for? Probably a good while, too. Defense 106, 108, 95, and 89. Okay, Mia gets one of them, that's for sure. I think we're both. She's our healer, after all. Alright. Rolling on down. How are we gonna get this thing back, though? I, I may have to reset the room in order to get the, the, the trees back to where they were before. Okay. This time we'll go this way. Regular nut. That's good for heals. That's all we can get to from this side, isn't it? Okay. Shoot on that one first, then. Uh, excuse me. Thank you. Okay. And to the left. And to the left. Oh, that was dumb. I can't go anywhere this direction. Whoops. Well, I flubbed that up. See, as far as puzzles go, it's not difficult, but it is time-consuming. Here, as we've learned, right is uh, the right way to go because left is dumb. And across, and up, and across, and up, and over. Does this lead somewhere I can actually make use of this, or no? Looks like no. I need to be able to fix this one somehow. Not like that. can pull it back like this, but I can't get to that now. If we find some other way around, it would be fine. Like here, but that doesn't help me, does it? No. Oh, there we go, we can get around. Cool. And then pull this one across even further, and we're good. Nice! Okay, we did it! All the way around. Oh, I can't. Wait, then how do I get the other one? Do I just have to like, run around the entire room to get that one? If so, I'll just come back for it after, because that's silly. <laughs> Fun, but silly. Another chest. Oh, it's a mimic. Oh. Mimic boss. Shoot, okay. Um, These things are pretty tough, so let's just hit whatever we got to start with. Flare Storm looks awesome! It's a cool icon. Tornado, pretty cool too, actually. Alright, let's go ahead and sick our remaining um, summons on it. I, uh, Isaac can do Boreas, he can do Meteor. Actually, no, um, Ivan can do Meteor because he's faster. And then it's just um, Ice Horn. There we go. Giant Meteor from the sky smashes into the little mimic. It'll survive, though, because they're pretty tough. I think summons Boreas, the giant ice golem, or ice machinery golem. Still in one piece. Sonic Slash. Ooh, ow. That is some intense damage. Okay. Ice Horn. Flare Storm. There we go. Nice. No level, but that's okay. Shove this across. We can back across here. I'll swing around and grab that uh, other item. Yeah, we can just go around. That'll work, I guess. Antidote. Oh. Well, that's kind of uh, unimpressive, really. But, you know, useful anyway. So it seems like this dungeon is just here for loot, which is totally fine. Should have Wish Well back. Or Wish, rather. Oh, he's a Gallant now. Gallant, Warrior, Mage, and Cleric. So with all of their gins on, they, 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 they have uh, much improved stats in a different class, which is very cool, actually. 
All right, so last time we came near a door, it bossed at us, so... Eh, I mean, having these on make us better fighters in general, but having the summons help us kill stuff really fast, so... I'm gonna be lazy and just keep doing that, because it works. Imagine if you fought, like, a really hard boss, it probably wouldn't be advisable to do this, but for anything that's kind of eh, you can just roll over them. Succubus and two grizzlies. Okay, that's a strange partnership, but I'm not gonna question it. Well, like, I don't want to question it. I don't want to know why a succubus is hanging around with two grizzly bears. I just don't want to know, thanks. Alright. Did less damage than the last boss, that's for sure. So these guys are definitely higher level. Glowers miserably at us. Attack drops. Okay, well, I don't need attack to drop. I can just hit you with summons. They survive too. They're definitely tougher. Bear Claw. 88 damage. Almost killed Isaac. Warius comes on down. If they take three summons, they're definitely like the next tier up. Yep. No, oh, one of them survived. Look at that. They took all four summons. Which means the next boss we, we probably want to take seriously then, because this one was almost too much to get just b burned down. Oh, and this puzzle looks more like the the uh, Mercury Lighthouse. Familiar. An elixir. Okay. So we need to push this one to push. No, wait, no. Actually, we cannot push that one even if we push this one. So let's go over here first. So we've got 111 coins on the first floor, 222 on the next floor. Lucky Pepper. Lucky Pepper? Oh, it boosts luck. Well, I should have guessed, I guess. Five, four, four, six. Give it to Garrett, I guess. Alright, so the first one we need to push is this one. We can go up that way, but it doesn't get us anywhere, so look back around this way. We can now push that one. Now that that one is gone, we can push this one. Now that that one is moved, we can push this one. It's a domino effect. One after the other, after the other, after the other. Eh, not too bad. Mystery Blade. That sounds cool. What does that do? Light Blade unleashes life nourish. 18 damage up from what Isaac's got now. Uh, tw 10 up from Garrett. A good chunk up for Ivan, but he usually casts anyway, so I'm not that keen to give it to him. And it would still be a far cry off of Isaac's damage anyway, so I'm gonna give it to Isaac, I think. There. Um, because that replaces the, the, the Claymore he had. Cool. Alright, so that was pretty easy. No Mimic here either, which is nice as well. Next boss. We go into this one with our gin on because it like we have almost double the stats when we have our gins on. Well, maybe maybe not double, but like we're we're significantly stronger. Lich appeared and two fiendish ghouls. All right, Ooh, what's Gaia? Seven. Oh, not as powerful as Quake Sphere, I don't think. Let's see what it looks like though. We have protect now. Why do I have that? Okay. Protect. Do I have um, a resistance version of that? No, I don't. So, let's go with Tornado. Ice Horn. So it's just two whirlwinds. Alright, fair enough. Oh, that's cool. That's very sweet. Doesn't do, it doesn't do as much damage as, as I was hoping, but it's pretty cool. Lich Class Glacier, which does damage. Ice Horn them back. Cannibal Fang. That's gonna hurt. No effect on Garrett. on Garrett? Oh, good. And then Garrett, who goes... See, th 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 this is the one reason why Garrett's kind of a lousy buffer. He goes last. Alright. Quake Sphere. Lair Storm. Storm Ray. And you're gonna need a wish to heal us all. Nobody down yet. He's lowering our defenses. Okay, so my buff almost didn't matter then. Just focus on attacking, then it's all good. There's the Flare Storm. Still nobody down. Okay, just keep pouring it on. We'll be fine. And I kind of want to keep healing, honestly. The 9 is kind of a steep steep uh, cast, so... Tornado! Quake Sphere! 
One down. Two down. Okay. Let's go for melee with our melee fighters. Eh, just melee the whole thing, honestly. It's fine. A crit from Ivan. Finish it off. Very nice, actually. Psy Crystal. Cool. What is that? Huh. I'm not sure what those are supposed to be, but they're kind of cool looking. I think they're keys, actually. But I can't reach them, is the thing. Oh, there's a red one, too. Okay, but well, what do I do about that exactly? I can't get to any of them. They're, uh, they're, they're, they're not at a straight angle from any of the um, other platforms. Could try using force, I guess. Nope, I went in a straight line. Apparently, Sunday doesn't work it on 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 angles. Okay. Not quite sure what to do with that then. Now this is this is uh, an optional dungeon, so it's possible that we just don't have whatever we need to do certain puzzles yet. I'm gonna try whatever I can do though, of course, but. So all these doors must co must correspond to one of these key things. Okay, we're in a straight line now. Does this do anything? Doesn't seem to. Uh, catch. Ah, oh, catch does work. Got the red key. Okay, so catch is the way to go for this one. How do we catch these? They're at funny angles. There's, there's no direction that allows us to look at them properly. The right will get us through here, but not through these, and these are the ones I want. Hmm. Maybe it's too far away. From here, maybe? Probably not, but... Oh, there's one blue key. There are certain directions you can do this from. Hmm. See, that doesn't work. Can you only get one blue key? Is that the trick, maybe? Because the rest of these are seem pretty determined not to do it. Actually, no, this one might work from this angle over here. Hang on. Okay, so there are certain angles that does work from. Fair enough. <laughs> Jump around a little bit here, find the right angle for this next one. There we go. And that one's gonna be the one down below it, I think. So better jump back down this way and across here. Nope. I was closer to, closer to it before than I was just now, but I did not realize it. There. There we go. Okay, that's all the keys. Now, back to the edge here. How many doors do we have? One, two, three, four. Okay, we have enough. Okay, open them all. So we're not burdened with anything key-wise. No, we're good. 333 coins. A fairy ring. A cookie. What does that do exactly? Boost. Oh, yeah, that's right. This is, this is the one that, that, that boosts maximum uh, synergy. 101, 89, 448, 148. I kind of want to give it to Mia because she uses the most for healing. I would use a pretty good amount as well. Garrett has the least, though. He's also less dependent on it, though. So I'm going to go ahead and give it to Mia, because she's the cat, the healer of the group. She needs it the most. Keep the rest of us alive. And lastly, smoke bombs. 
Kind of unimpressed by those, but that's neither here nor there. All right. Not too bad. How's our stats? Uh, we're doing all right for ourselves. I'm gonna pop a quick wish just to make sure. All right, next boss. Tempted to pop out the the, the summon gins, but we're, we already know it's not gonna work out so well for us. We don't want to do summons and then get killed by accident. Two griffins. Check that out. All right, mighty earthen barrier. Defense. Speed. Nah, make, make, make that resistance. Makes makes more sense to just take that the first time around. And then... Nah, yeah, I'm fine with her not, actually. I, I, I'd rather her have Wish. Alrighty. Shields for everyone. Increase our resistances so we don't get smacked around by synergy too much. Impact, that's gonna be physical, right? No, it's uh, buffing itself. Huh, cool. Nice horn. Corona. Not too shabby. Let's go with Flint. Speed now. And we can just keep on pounding on them. Focus on the one on the left for now, because, I mean, you know, the sooner one of them dies, the better off we'll be. Venus is their best element uh, for, to, for, to fight them with. It makes sense, because they're... they're Mer or, um, Jupiter aligned, I would imagine, being flying creatures. Ivan's in a bit of a trouble there. I want to heal him quickly. Sap. Go ahead and summon Kieran. So I don't. I, I'm. I'm. I'm not using them to like. You know. Attack twice next round. Gust. Smog. Smog would be good. I don't want to kill him though. Let's just go with Atalanta. And you can use Wishwell. Because I'm not trying to, 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 to pull out, like, the big summons. I'm just trying to, you know, make use of the djinn. Okay, Wish comes down. Everyone gets healed. That'll hopefully keep Ivan alive. Summon Kirin. Because, like, even the level 2 summons do, you know, as much or more than our, our, our actual uh, spells do. Wing Flutter. Yeah, not too bad. We got this. Oh yeah, that's right. You're you're still working on yours, aren't you? Okay. Summon Sybil. You're already all ginned out, so you just attack. You're gonna cast Tornado. And you're gonna cast Wish again. Tree Frog of Doom! Still not any any uh, budge on these guys. They're pretty tough. Everyone gets healed. Garrett gets his weapon attack and kills one. Awesome. Alright, resetting Jin to our guys, so they're gonna have more oomph. Everyone just, just uh, gang on the bird, we should be fine. Barrage again. Not dead, but doing pretty well for ourselves. Reset some more Jin to us. Our stats all going up. Life nourish. Ooh. That's very cool, actually. Nice. Level 19 Knight. He's a Gallant, technically, but he hasn't got all of his gin on yet. Uh, we're in a reveal mode, huh? Come on, let's catch. Whoops, need to go ahead and put uh, reveal back on. Interesting. I can go around. Why would I? Oh, I see. There's different paths. Okay, fair enough. Can I, can I move? What the? Oh. Oh, I see. I, 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 it's, it's, it's not reveal. We, we, it's halt we need. Hold still, please. Thank you. Sleep bomb. Oh. And she's just pushy. Fair enough. Okay, we'll go around for that one. Must be another trick to it around here somewhere. I can try to halt her from here, but I'm, I'm assuming I cannot halt two things at once. Hmm. 
Maybe I have to. Can I halt two things at once? Because if not, I'm not, I'm not getting past her either. No, I don't seem to be able to. Huh. I can't reach her from here is the thing. Hmm. This might be an issue. I can't reach either of them. See, the thing is, there's shadow on this side. And I remember there being someone who mentioned something about, uh, in Loonpa, I believe it was, you ha it said, I'd have to be a shadow to sneak into Loonpa. I'm wondering if that's the trick here. I'm wondering if we cannot solve this puzzle yet. Because I think that there's a, there's, there's most likely going to be a synergy that let, 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 lets us hide in shadows. Because it was mentioned at Loonpa, and there's now a, a, a one, one third of this path that is covered in shadow, and that's gotta be significant. Because I cannot reach her to, to, to use halt on her, it just doesn't, just, it doesn't work. Like, this is, this, is, this is as close as I can go, and it doesn't reach. So, I don't think we have any choice but to come back later. So, I think that's as far into this bonus dungeon as we can get today. So, that's going to be Crossbone Isle for now, you guys. We got the Mystery Blade. See, we can't, can't go this way either for, 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 for the same reason. But there's still Shadow there as well. So, yeah. I think that's probably going to be as far as we can go on Crossbone Isle today. So, I'm going to return to the ship. Actually, no, let's uh, take a take... Have a, have, have, a, have a look around, because I haven't actually looked around the island itself yet, have I? Except for that weird, um, not, 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 not cave puzzle, but it was, it was like, 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 like a cliff face puzzle. So we'll check there quickly first, and then we'll see what else is on the island. Not there, sorry. We'll check around the island first, and then we'll end it here, I think. Because we'll be resuming our voyage to Tolby in the next one, and going to Colosso, the great fighting tournament for warriors. Which, as I recall, is actually pretty fun, because they take away all of your items and stuff, and you have to, like, like uh, do challenges to, like, earn them back, which is pretty cool, actually. It's a neat system. Okay. So, looping around to the left side of the island here. This looks like beach to me. Nice view, though. Lovely blue ocean. Looks like not much is going on, though. Yeah. Not seeing anything happening, and we're back at the ship now. How was it, Isaac? Did you explore the island thoroughly? Yep. Well, did you see the monsters out there? Yes, I did. I see. Then we cannot let the tourists go ashore after all. The passengers are going as stir crazy. They're out of control. You have, let, you have to let the passengers go ashore. There would be no need for that. Figured out the course to Tolby. Oh, good. Really? We can go. We can go. Arr, let's go to Tolby before the sea is any rougher. Tell our tourists they can enjoy a nice long break after we arrive. No, it's too late. Nothing we can say will calm them down now. If we hurry, we can make them to... Mm. If we be hurry, we can make it to Colosso in time. <gasps> I see! If we get them to, to Colosso, the, 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 then they'll all be happy for sure. Right, so everyone's problems seem to be solved. Duh. Go and tell the tourists. Or he will. Go and tell the tourists. Cool. It's not much to fire there. We'll ask the oarsmen to work till the very end, and we'll get there on time. All right, so we're gonna fix the oarsmen. Oh, they're, they're gonna switch the left and right teams. Okay. So we're gonna correct our, our, our course by putting the, the the weak people on 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 the left and the stronger people on the right. That's fair enough. Cool. So yeah, we've uh, course corrected. They're gonna get the 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 the, the, the oarsmen going again, and we're we'll arriving in Tolby next time. Because I don't think there's anything else that happens that's any particular interest um, at this stage of the game. Because we beat the Kraken, we we, we saw Crossbone Isle, and I'm pretty sure we're done at this point. So thanks so much for watching, you guys. It's been awesome. Um, you know, I I, I I love this game, so I'm always happy to 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 record it. Hopefully, those of you that watch it enjoy it as well. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one. For now, have a great rest of your day. Enjoy your 4th of July festivities, and uh, have a good one.